The WWDC countdown has begun iOS 16 and every other major Apple operating system is going to be updated very very soon. What's gonna happen, when can you watch it, how can you watch it and every other thing about DubDub as it's often called, I'm gonna tell you in this video. Welcome geeks, you're watching iGeeks Blog. my name is Lakshay and let's get started with today's video. Starting things off is the when of it, that is basically the dates are out 6th to the 10th of June 2022. Of course, it's gonna be online again. The it's been a couple of years since Apple has been hosting online events. COVID is still affecting all of us guys. Mask up, stay safe and hope to God that the next iPhone event that happens in September, not dub dub, the iPhone event is in person. This one for now is online. Now how can you watch it? Well, it's pretty easy. Just head on over to Apple's official YouTube account. Not right now, in June when the event comes around and you can also even watch it on Apple's own website actually. Just don't fall for those fake websites or fake YouTube accounts that promise to host the video, that promise to show the video but then they lead you to somewhere else. Don't fall for those. Make sure you head on over to Apple's official website or their YouTube account. Now comes the big one. What is coming? Well, we know iOS 16 will come at DubDub, but Apple's every other operating system is also going to get updated for the next year, which means new updates for iPadOS, new updates for macOS, new updates for watchOS, tvOS, even the HomePod operating system, every other operating system that Apple has. It's a software event, right? So everything new is going to be announced in June. But don't get your hopes up, new updates will come to you in this fall, maybe around September, maybe even later. The announcement is going to happen in June. Now of course this does not mean that you have to wait around till DubDub rolls around in June, you can still watch every new thing that is going to come in iOS 16. Now hold on, these are our expectations based on leaks and rumors and what we hope to see from Apple. This is by no means confirmed, we know that nothing is confirmed until Apple actually unveils it. So we've compiled all of the leaks, all of the rumors in one video, it's gonna be linked here and in the description, you can check that out and to know all about iOS 16 and every other iOS version, every other Mac OS, iPad OS, everything else about Apple, subscribe to the iGeeks blog channel and watch all of our videos, turn on notifications for everything. Now of course we know WWDC is a software event after all, it is the Worldwide Developers Conference. So there aren't really any hardware launches, but Apple has in the past released hardware devices at WWDC, which means there is a slight chance, a very tiny chance that we could see some new hardware in this year's WWDC as well. And which is the one thing we're truly waiting for? Yes, a brand new Mac Pro. Now Apple did tease a Mac Pro at the end of their peak performance event way back in March, but they didn't tell us much about it, they just told us that it's gonna happen. So here's to hope, here's hoping that Apple releases the new Mac Pro at WWDC with uh, an M1 chip, an M1 Ultra or maybe an upgraded version of it. One more thing we're expecting Apple to release at WWDC is, well hopefully, the new AR VR headset. There are a lot of leaks, a lot of rumors about it. Now we hope that Apple does it, but honestly, personally, I don't think Apple is going to announce it. Maybe they can do a sneak peek of it, maybe they can preview it, but definitely not releasing it at WWDC. Some other things that we're definitely not going to see at WWDC is, well, a new iPhone. Guys, just don't expect new iPhones at a developer event, okay? No iPhones, no iPads, maybe not even a new MacBook Air that we're really waiting for, but maybe Apple does it, who knows? But then again, AirPods Pro second generation is one more product that all of us are dearly waiting for not gonna happen at WWDC might happen in the September event where Apple introduces new iPhones and maybe they can introduce a new AirPod then. But not gonna happen at WWDC. Now coming back to that Apple's AR VR headset mixed reality headset. Now I personally have a lot of thoughts. There are a lot of leaks floating around about it. Bloomberg's Mark Gurman has also pointed out that this may launch in 2022 or it may not. It could possibly be delayed till 2023. Now once again, like I said, there are a lot of things floating around. So if you want me to make a dedicated video explaining what exactly is happening, what might happen, do let me know in the comments down below. If a lot of you want to know about it, then I'll surely make a video on it. Now that was it about WWDC for now. Remember, the event is happening from the 6th to the 10th of June 2022, but the main event, the main keynote is going to happen on the 6th of June where Apple will unveil all of their new operating systems. And to stay up to date on every new thing that Apple will announce, the iOS 15, oh wait, no, 
आई वेज सिक्सटीन एवरी न्यू थिंग दैट इज हैपनिंग एट डब्ल्यू डब्ल्यू डी सी जिस कीप वॉचिंग ऑल ऑफ आर वीडियोज राइट हेयर ऑन आई गीक्स ब्लॉग सी यू गाइज इन द नेक्स्ट वन